Welcome to Smithville Tech Support. Everyone has experienced a situation when watching a program on a streaming service like Netflix or in the middle of playing a game online and everything freezes. Frustrating as it may be, here are a few troubleshooting tips you can do to save time when speaking to a technician on the phone, which may potentially resolve your issue. First, if you have phone service with us, you will want to check to make sure that it is working properly. If it is not, then you will want to watch the video for when all fiber services are out. Visit youtube.com slash Smithville Media and search our technical support videos for Fiber All Services Out. To start, you will want to determine what kind of device is connected to the fiber jack. Your fiber jack looks similar to a phone outlet, but is slightly thicker and is red on the inside. From here, you are likely either hardwired to a computer or plugged into a wireless router. A wireless router connects all of your devices to the internet via Wi-Fi or an Ethernet connection. Some common brands include Asus, D-Link, Linksys, Netgear and TP-Link, though there are many others. Typical routers have five Ethernet ports in the back. Four of these are local area network ports and will likely be labelled LAN with a corresponding number. You should notice an additional port on the router. This port, the Wide Area Network or WAN port, is the one you will want to focus on. The Ethernet cable that comes out of the fibre wall jack should be plugged into this port, which is sometimes called the Internet port. Whether you are plugged into a router or a computer, you will want to follow these troubleshooting tips. Disconnect and reconnect the cable from each end, making sure the Ethernet cable is securely connected. Determine this by lightly pulling on each end. If the cable feels loose or pops out of the device it is plugged into, then it is likely the cable that has gone bad. If the cable is now securely in place, wait a few seconds to allow the hardware to recognize the connection and check to see if you have a connection to the internet. If you still don't have internet, try swapping out the ethernet cable with another one. Following these steps will help us narrow down your issue and will better assist our technicians in determining where the problem lies. If you still don't have internet, have additional questions or need more help, contact us and a technical support specialist will be happy to assist you. That number is 866 470 2583. Thanks for watching. If this video helped you, be sure to subscribe to our channel, youtube.com slash Smithville Media, where you will find more technical support videos and other great local content.